Hey guys, Zeno coming from Essence of Zen here. In our previous video, we showed you how to update Atlasian Source Tree uh, embedded Mercurial version. Today, we're going to show you how to update the embedded Git version. Now, if you're a developer, then you probably should already have Git installed via the Git GUI, or or you can utilize the actual Git PowerShell. you can see what version of Git that you're running. However, if you want to keep things simple and continue using Git through, let's say, Source Trees Terminal or the Source Trees system, for Git Bash and everything, then essentially what you can do is go to Tools, Options, Git, and if you're using an outdated version, such as Git version 1.9.5, you can actually update the embedded Git. But once the update is complete, you'll now notice that the embedded version of Git is 2.8.1, meaning that I have updated the embedded Git system for source tree. If we move back over to my PowerShell with the systems version of Git, you'll notice that I'm still using 2.7.4. So the system Git and the embedded Git are actually two separate entities. But yeah, that's how you update the embedded Git with Atlassian's source tree. I've been Zona coming from Essence of Zen. Feel free to subscribe if you want to see more. Leave any questions you have in the comment section below. Feel free to check out our website, www.essenceofzen.org, as well as our forum, forum.essenceofzen.org. And I'll see you all in the next video. But until then, as always, take care.